Hey guys, Christina here. I'm back with the Goodwill haul. So um, I'm really excited to show you guys what I got. Um, I've had a lot of goodies. So I went to two Goodwills this weekend and I'm just loving everything that I got. I need to stop going to Goodwill because you guys, I'm going to be a hoarder. But I think I know where everything is going to go. So I try to keep that in mind when I'm shopping there at thrift stores, especially because I just want to make sure that I have a home for everything that I'm not coming home and just collecting like clutter <laughs> so I try guys I do try um, and then if you guys hear chirping it's my smoke detector I changed the batteries I reset it I did everything I don't know why it's still doing that so I'm gonna have to have my husband look at that when he gets home but if you guys hear that that is what that is so I do apologize okay I'm gonna jump right in um, I got this milk glass plate or it's like a shallow dish but it's really cute it was only 49 cents and for now, it's just going to go in my milk glass collection until I find a home for it. But just loving that. I couldn't say no for 49 cents. Um, I got this Stuart Little movie for my son. Uh, Daniel loves Stuart Little. And we used to have this movie, but it was like super scratched. And it's still in the original plastic from Big Lots. They wanted $3.99. And it was half off blue and white this weekend, so I got it for $2. So couldn't say no to that. I love it. And I know he's going to love it. I got these super cute, um, three of them, these little eggs that you hang like on a Easter tree or something, and they're painted, oh, let's see if you guys can see them, that one's a chick, that one is a bunny, like that, and then this one's another bunny, and they're foam, so they're not like super high quality, but I just thought they were cute for Easter, 49 cents each, I mean, I couldn't, I couldn't say no, I keep showing you guys upside down, don't I? 49 cents. But for Easter, I know you guys can hang them on those like metal trees, and I know I sometimes I've seen them at the dollar store, um, sometimes at Michael's, so I'll definitely be looking out for that during the spring. I got these super cute bottles. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. I think they're going to go in my bathroom, but we'll see. They're just super, super cute. This one's like a mercury glass. Matches my room. Hello. Love it. And this one is just like a frosted glass. Super cute. Um, this one was $3.99, and this one was $2.99. A little pricey, but I just couldn't say no because they're adorable. So I'm going to keep these forever. I'm going to keep them in my bathroom most likely, but I will show you guys what I do with those later. Um, I got this little um, stand. I think it's a candlestick holder. I don't know what it is, but it's super cute. It had melted wax in it, so I think that's what they used it for. I got it for $2.99. And I just love it. I think it has like a nice little patina to it. Um, I might stick up for fall and I could put like a candle or even put some pumpkins on it. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with this yet, but I'm sure I'm going to use it out in my living room. We'll see. Loving that. Um, I got this cute little tin to hang up in my kitchen and it was 99 cents. Again, half off of white tag, so it was 50 cents. And I couldn't just say no because it's going to look adorable in my kitchen. I have a country kitchen. Can't say no to that. Loving that. Let's see. What else can I show you guys? Okay, I got this jar. Now, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But it was just too cute. I couldn't say no. I just love the color. There's something about this, like, amber, like, yellow color. I don't know. But it's just beautiful. I love it. And it was $3.99, half off blue. So... What is that? Two dollars. Hello, I'm loving it. Two dollars. What am I gonna do with that for two dollars? I could. I don't know. I don't know. But I just couldn't say no. Two dollars. I love it. So, most likely to go in my kitchen, but I might throw it in my bathroom. We'll see. I'm not quite sure yet, but I'm loving it. So, it's pretty. It's pretty. I couldn't say no. Um. Okay. This piece. <sighs> okay. I don't know what it is. You guys know that I started collecting. Um vintage purses like I love the beaded vintage purses but they're hard to find I do find them every now and then but not in very good condition sometimes and I almost got one today but I just wasn't sure because it looked like tore up <laughs> so I saw this and I something in my head I don't know if you guys do this but you just have this great idea that you're just gonna start collecting something well that's me and then so I started I think I'm gonna start collecting these brooches I don't know that it's vintage or anything but I just thought it was really cute and pretty. Um, it's got a nice little clasp in the back. But I just loved it. I thought it was super cute. So I got this one for, let's see, for 3 dollars 
And again, I'm going to display it probably in my Curo cabinet, make it like a nice little display. So, excuse me. Sorry, I had to sneeze. <laughs> but anyways, um, I'm just loving it. I think it's super cute. So I'm going to have to start looking out for these. I know they're hard to find. I do look for them when I go, but I can never find them. So I found one and I'm excited. I must be getting sick or something. <sighs> just keep sneezing. Okay, this piece is like one of my favorites because it's just gorgeous and I cannot believe the price because Goodwill sometimes overprices stuff and a lot of times I will walk away from like amazing pieces just because they decided to overprice it ridiculously. So I found this cute mercury glass, um, like what is this called? I can't even think of what the like hammered look, but it's super cute guys. I mean, I'm thinking I'm going to put this in my living room as a candy dish. It's just super cute. And I paid 79 cents. Oh my God. I was like, heck yeah, <laughs> I'm taking you home. This guy is super cute, guys. I love it. I could even throw this in my bedroom, my bathroom, but I think it's going to go in my living room. So loving that. Okay. I think I got through all the small stuff. Now I got a couple of bigger pieces to show you. And it's going to be kind of hard to show you where I'm at. So I think I might have to stand up, but um, we'll see what we can do. So this piece, I found it lying up on the top rack. I mean, it was like way high and I could just see like this like interesting looking thing. And so I saw it and it was like this. And I was like, hmm, what is that? It's some sort of picture frame. So I went to go grab it down and nearly dropped it because <laughs> it was so, so heavy. I was like, oh my God, <laughs> I couldn't believe how heavy it was. But anyways, it is this super cute Santa and you open it up and it's like a totally cute accordion door, you guys. And it's got a snowman in the middle and then it's got another Santa in the other side. And I just thought it was super cute. Um, for Christmas, I could put it like on my mantle or even like displayed in the corner on my porch outside. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with it yet, but I couldn't say no, it was too cute. And then, um, how much did I pay for this sucker? I think it was like $5. Yeah, it was $4.99. Can you guys see that? So I couldn't pass it up. I normally, I try to stay away from Christmas stuff at Goodwill because I have tons of Christmas decorations, you guys. I'm not even joking. I don't even put out half of my decorations because I have so much. <laughs> but um, I couldn't say no to this because I don't have anything like it. And it was just, like I said, super duper cute. So it's going to go probably on my mantle, but we'll have to stay tuned on Christmas to see what I do with that. But again, that was just super cute. I couldn't say no. And then this piece is probably my favorite um, just because it's totally me. I love it. Um, and I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. I think it's just going to stay in my room for now, but let me show you. Is this super cute? I don't know if you guys can see it. It stands up. It's just like, um, I think I'm just going to use it for magazines. But like on here it says, and these come out, it just says like to do. And then on the bottom one, it says to file. But I just thought it would be super cute to just throw magazines in it. Like, let me show you. So like that. So even if I throw it in the bathroom, you know. I don't know. I just I thought it was super cute. So um, I couldn't pass it up. And it had the original price from TJ Maxx for $24.99. Can you guys see that? Um, and they had it marked for $5.99. Can you believe that? $5.99. So... And the only thing I found wrong with it was this scratch right here, <laughs> or this, it's like tore right there, but I think I'm just going to get like a Sharpie and fill that in, and I don't know, I just thought it was so cute, I couldn't say no to it, so I don't know, bathroom, bedroom, any suggestions, let me know, but I don't know, I couldn't say no, it was too cute. So I think that does it, I think that's all, all I got from Goodwill, you guys tons of goodies. I am just like super excited with everything that I got. I cannot wait to put it out and find a home for it. So I need to do a video of like how I kind of display my Goodwill finds in my home. So if that's something you guys are kind of interested in seeing, let me know. I'm more than happy to do it. Um, and I'm always changing stuff in and out. Like if I get a new piece to replace a different piece, like I like to move things out for seasons. So my house never looks the same, but if you guys want to see something like that, let me know. 
thank you guys for watching it was super fun I had such a great time I love love Goodwill I love thrifting and just because you guys thrift does not mean things have to look tacky your home does not have to look like a freaking thrift store <laughs> you know what I mean the best way to do it is go get a piece look at it for a minute and kind of think of where you'd put it when you get home and that's kind of what I do so that being said I will leave you guys with that thank you guys so much for watching I will see you guys next time I have a few more videos coming out I just filmed um, a kitchen tour and um, a pantry organization that I did um, and all that stuff so if you guys uh, are interested in seeing any of those um, look for those coming up within the week so stay tuned for that guys I will see you guys next time and bye